everyone it is thursday 9 a.m and i'm just gonna i'm just about to have my coffee and my breakfast <laughs> starting my computer right now i didn't go to the gym this morning it is my time of the of the month so i'm being a bit more gentle with myself i did do yoga a session of yoga and then i had my meditation and so now it's time for breakfast I'm just about to do a bit of admin work, um, just take care of different things and after that I'm actually heading to a camera store in a nearby shopping center because my new lens has arrived. When the Boxing Day came around I actually completely forgot that it's the time of sales, that all the shops have sales and basically just everybody goes shopping and, <laughs> and you buy things at discounts. On Boxing Day I actually went out in the morning for a walk with a friend of mine and then during the walk I messaged another friend about catching up and she said she was actually out uh, doing Boxing Day shopping and so I thought whoa um, do I want anything? <laughs> Is there something that I would like to go and shop for? And I actually couldn't think of anything except one thing. That one thing came to mind and that was getting a new camera lens. This is a specific wide-angle lens for vlogging which is going to make my life easier when it comes to the doing the vlogging um, but they didn't have it in store so I they had to order it so it's finally finally here and I'm going to pick it up today and another interesting exciting thing that happened um, I think last night was that my vlogging channel reached um, 200 subscribers 200 subscribers within I think two weeks of of vlogging I think that's quite significant and I am so excited and so happy 200 people so far have chosen to watch and follow my personal journey so we've got 203 subscribers as of this morning which is really really fun and exciting <laughs> shopping for some hiking gear. I need a few things like a better backpack and a little lunchbox <laughs> and maybe sort of a jacket that will protect me from the wind uh, and the elements so that's the next thing and then I'm gonna have to find a print shop because I have a document I need to print um, for my business and I need to sign and then return and then after that I'll be heading back home for, uh, for lunch. Terribly successful with my shopping. I did get my camera lens, so I am very happy, <laughs> very excited about that. I got my wide angle lens. That's gonna be a lot of fun for me. And in terms of other other things that I wanted, I got myself a little lunchbox to take with me on my hiking trips. I got some facial oil. I got some little hand towels because I needed fresh ones and I got runners for um, walking. My walking shoes 
I had to I had to get rid of um because they were no good anymore and that's it I am not great with shopping I lose my patience very very quickly and so I have like literally a half an hour window where I need to get everything done and past that moment I just start getting really really impatient and I just want to finish and I want to go home and I want to move on <laughs> into into other things so that's my little shopping haul hope you hope you like it uh, and then you know so what I what I do is when I um, when I decide that okay I'm just not gonna buy anymore because I can't find things or I don't have the patience for it I just decide that I can make do with stuff I have at home so I guess this is my maybe better this way because I buy less and I just keep reusing the things I already have At this stage of this video, you might be asking yourself, Helena, what the fuck? <laughs> what is this video actually about? Why are you dragging us all over, all over the shop, quite literally? And what is actually going on here today in this vlog? And this is a very good question. And the answer is, I don't know. <laughs> quite honestly, I've been just wondering what this whole vlogging channel is really about that's like the bigger picture i knew i wanted to vlog today and i was wondering what do i want to make as a focus of this vlog and i haven't really made up my mind until now when i realized that this kind of uh i guess internal struggle around what do i make today's vlog about this kind of reflects pretty well my desire to make this vlog about something more than just my day-to-day -day life and that's definitely gonna be there and that's fun but i also want to give this vlog a sort of a bigger theme so what's coming to me is this and hear me out i feel like a lot of you have been commenting on my personal journey from the sort of poor uninspiring upbringing up to the point of basically living the life of my dreams and how i managed to make that shift that, that transition and maybe even some tips and ideas on how you can do a similar thing in your own life if you feel like you're not quite living the life of your dreams where you're not fully driven by your passion etc so i feel like this could be a really really good focal point here because my i guess biggest desire in my life is to live a life where i am fully expressing myself as a human being to my absolutely fullest potential and I don't quite feel like I am doing it right now so thank you so much to everybody who has been inspired by my journey so far and who has left me such beautiful comments and messages and emails with your words of support and appreciation but I really feel like I am still definitely on the journey and probably I will always be on the journey of becoming the, that fullest version of myself of fully expressing myself as a human being so this is quite important every time you feel excited about something and you feel that you desire something it is because you're capable of creating it in your life all these things that i ever wanted and that i created at one point they were just an idea they were just a, an exciting desire even if at times I didn't believe that I could actually make it happen. So I would love to sort of bring the focus here to these different tools and techniques and practices that I've been using over the years to bring my life to this point where it is right now. Because I've learned so much on this journey. Uh, it's been so many years in the making, so many years of learning, studying, practicing, trying, failing, trying again, succeeding a bit, then trying again even more and keep back like, just keeping at it and keeping at it and keeping at it because I am very, very stubborn. <laughs> Not very patient. I'm learning patience, but I am very, very stubborn. 
if I want something, if I truly believe that I should have it or that it, like, something excites me, I will put a lot into creating that in my life. And at this stage, I absolutely and truly believe that whenever there is that kind of spark of interest or excitement or passion in your life about anything, it is because absolutely without a doubt, this is meant for you. Basically, that excitement is showing you a path towards your deeper, richer fulfillment as a human being. And so many people doubt that. So many people feel like this is, so many things are just beyond their ability to create, attract and manifest amazing things into their lives. And I really want to send that message loud and clear. Anything that you want, anything that you desire, you can create. You just need to know how to do it. What are the right tools? What are the, what is the path of getting there? And this is where so many people get, get lost. I've been learning for so many years now and it's been paying such amazing dividends in my life. So please let me know how that sounds as an idea. If this is something you would like to watch or do you feel like there are maybe certain adjustments that we could make, that I could make here to this channel so that um, it just brings even more value. Because yes, I do have my main channel where I teach sex education and um, help people have basically amazing sex lives through different sexual techniques and practices. And I am very passionate about that channel and I will keep running it. It's just so such a powerful thing. But I want this vlogging channel to sort of stand alone and be powerful in its own right. So yeah, let me know. <laughs> how that sounds to you guys and if that's something you would like to watch and learn more about or if you feel like maybe you have some other tips or ideas or insight into where I could excel in my vlogging channel so that it not only entertains but it also inspires and educates. I really look forward to hearing from you. Please make sure to leave your comments and insights and ideas and questions etc in the comments below. I will be responding to that. And I might be using your idea <laughs> to kind of uh, refine the vision and the idea behind this vlogging channel. Thank you so much for that. And I will see you all very, very soon in my next vlog episode. Bye.